day, everyone. First and foremost, we would like to introduce ourselves. I am Trisha Haruyan. And I am Chaska Andrea Anio. Considered to be the father of modern atomic theory, John Dalton was also a pioneer of weather forecast and was one of the first scientists to use homemade instruments to make weather observations. Much of his early works and observations using meteorological instruments laid the foundation for the study of weather forecasting. His fascination with, for the weather and atmosphere led him to pursue research on the nature of gases, which in turn laid the ground on which he built the atomic theory. Today, he is known primarily for his work on atomic theory, and although more than two centuries years old, his theory still remains valid in the field of modern chemistry. John Dalton proposed a basic model of the atom that helped establish many specific concepts and also created the foundation for more modern models. His model suggested that atoms are the smallest particle of an element, that atoms of different elements have different masses, and that they are solid, indestructible units, much like a billiard ball. And this is where the billiard ball model arises. All matter is made of atoms. Dalton hypothesized that the law of conservation of mass and the law of definite proportions could be explained using the idea of atoms. He proposed that all matter is made of tiny indivisible particles called atoms, which he imagined as solid, massy, hard, impenetrable, movable particles. It is important to note that since Dalton didn't have the necessary instruments to see or otherwise experiment on individual atoms, he did not have any insight into whether they might have any internal structure. All atoms of a given element are identical in mass and properties. Dalton proposed that every single atom of an element, such as gold, is the same as every other atom of that element. He also noted that the atoms of one element differ from the atoms of all other elements. Today, we still know this to be mostly true. A sodium atom is different from a carbon atom. Elements may share some similar boiling points, melting points, and electronegativities, but no two elements have the same exact set of properties. Compounds are combinations of two or more different types of atoms. In the third part of Dalton's atomic theory, he proposed that compounds are combinations of two or more different types of atoms. An example of such a compound is table salt. Table salt is a combination of two separate elements with unique physical and chemical properties. In comparison of Dalton's theory with the concept of Democritus, there isn't much difference but more of the similarities. Matter consists of indivisible atoms. Atoms are unchangeable. Compounds are made of molecules. All atoms or molecules of a pure substance are identically alike. In chemical reactions, Atoms are only rearranged, neither being created nor destroyed. Thank you. For further inquiries, don't hesitate to comment in the comment box down below. Don't forget to hit like and subscribe to our channel. Thank you for watching.